Today's topic is diabolemia. Definition. Diabolemia is a word coined from two medical conditions, diabetes and bulimia. Diabetes describes a metabolic disease whereby a person has high blood sugar due to an inability to metabolize sufficient quantity of the hormone insulin. Bulimia is an eating disorder. Diabulimia describes the diagnosis of an eating disorder in an individual with type 1 diabetes. A diabetes patient cannot produce insulin in their body. So they need insulin injections to permit their body to process glucose and avoid complications. An individual suffering from diabetes deliberately turns the insulin intake into a weight control mechanism by reducing the prescribed dosage, entirely omitting their insulin dosage, by rendering the insulin inactive through certain manipulations. Females of all ages are twice likely to fall the victim when they have type 1 diabetes. Women who withhold insulin to lose weight die an average of 10 years earlier than women without an eating disorder. Causes Explicit to diabulimia, countless factors impact the increased risk of developing an eating disorder, alongside type 1 diabetes. A. The inception of insulin treatment is often accompanied by weight gain, particularly among adolescents. This change oftentimes can be physically and emotionally uncomfortable and can result in the manipulation of insulin intake for weight loss. B. To effectively manage type 1 diabetes, dietary constraints and meal formulations are important. This can create a toxic concentration on food. C. Depression and anxiety are among the common psychological effects of having to deal with type 1 diabetes. They are also among the factors that prompt an eating disorder. Signs and Symptoms the warning signs and symptoms of diabolemia are both emotional and physical. Emotional symptoms include increased disregard of diabetes management, depression or anxiety, constant fear of being fat due to insulin injections, anxiety about body image, strict food rules, withdrawal from friends and family, rigorous exercise, fear of low blood sugar, Physical symptoms include yeast infection, lack of menstruation, fatigue, unexplained weight loss, dry hair and skin, blurry vision, vomiting, frequent thirst and urination, low sodium and potassium, slow wound healing. Diagnosis. It is common for diabolemia patients to go undiagnosed for many years as they simply fool their diabetes educator. To diagnose bulimia in a type 1 diabetes patient, the healthcare provider should carry out hemoglobin A1 test. Hemoglobin A1 test is a type of blood test that is used to check and monitor people with diabetes. If the hemoglobin test shows a high hemoglobin level that is greater than 7%, it may indicate a drop in insulin intake by the patient. This may signal a case of diabolemia. Treatment to handle the issue associated with diabolemia, one needs to employ the help of multiple professionals that have deep knowledge of the eating disorder. The patient may need to see an endocrinologist who works with your healthcare provider to try and prescribe the best possible treatment, a nutritionist who has multiple knowledge of diabetes and eating disorder to help develop an effective and healthy dieting plan, a mental health professional with experience in dealing with such cases, the mental health provider helps in developing methods that help you cope with stress and monitor mood that affects the eating pattern. Other treatment may include joining a group therapy program where you can get the needed support from other people going through diabolemia, family-based therapy, which involves the whole family support. This can be helpful for a parent with kids dealing with diabolemia. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.